Здравствуйте, товарищи, and welcome back to another episode of our glorious workers and resources Soviet Republic Let's Play. Yet another solid episode planned today where we're going to make some serious progress uh, once more looking at fulfilling the needs of our people. We have been neglecting some of those bare necessities for a while and uh, I think it's about time we put a stop to that and maybe focus a little bit on getting food and meat and clothes to the people properly back at, uh, you know, well, <laughs> everywhere, not just any one place. We have a couple of issues regarding that. Uh, and apart from that, we're going to, of course, let uh, some of our construction continue and complete. Hopefully, we're going to see this entire section get completed today. Of course, the important stuff is done already. Of course, that's, you know, top priority. That and, and the fields, of course. Uh, but apart from that, hopefully, we're going to, yeah, see everything over here finished. So we have some more people. And off in the distance, I hope Rostinsky gets completed as well. Just a quick note about uh, this area, actually. The plan is that once this area has been, you know, built up and completed, we're going to bring people to this train station over here, and from here, take people over to Farminsky. Uh, many of you in the comments were mentioning that uh, this is way too long a round trip to go all the way from there, across this way, down and over. And I agree, that's way too long a route. So that's why, that's part of the train Rexky expansion over here, is to get more people uh, traveling a shorter path to Farminsky. We could make a small village outside and around Farminsky as well, if push comes to shove. But I think for now, this should be enough for us, uh, as long as we actually get people, you know, coming through and living there. Oh my god, what is this traffic jam? I need to do something about this. And that's actually one of the main things we're going to tackle today, is the traffic situation and the blockages in traffic. Uh, basically what I'm saying is, uh, we're going to stop trucking around with our delivery mechanisms. My god. Oh, that's not entirely accurate. Because it's a, it's a substitute word. We're still going to be using trucks. So let's get to it, folks. I want to mention, though, really quickly, though, uh, if you've been enjoying the series, uh, and it seems like quite a few have been enjoying the series, which is great to see, if that is still your state, that is still your uh, mind space, that you still enjoy the series, make sure you let me know by leaving a like and a comment down below. As I've always said, it makes a very big difference in how I approach content on this channel. It's why this uh, Let's Play is continuing. It's because so many of you are still tuning in and you're still leaving comments and likes. It's great to see uh, because I've been enjoying it, so... It's good to know that you guys have been as well. Uh, with that said, you know, yeah, leave your likes and comments down below. With that said, we're going to take a look at... Actually, I should also mention, a surprising number of viewers are not subscribed to the channel. So, if you haven't subscribed, maybe consider subscribing as well. Because this is a constant flow on my channel every Wednesday and Sunday. Uh, so, you know, if you subscribe, you'll get notifications. And other city builders and stuff I cover as well, you'll get notifications. Uh, so, yeah, it's, it's like 45 to 60% are unsubscribed. Anyway, sorry, I distracted myself. There have been a couple of things pointed out in the comments. So the first thing that uh, I'm going to take a look at is the number of students that are at this train platform. What I need to do about these students is I need to get them to the university all the way over here. So it might be time to get another bus getting maybe, uh, maybe we'll get one of these chav buses, 55 workers or 55 is a capacity. So if we get one, I mean, We'll try and we'll try and start with cha the Chav bus. I think I do like these. Um, oh god, I'm gonna, accordion buses, but I don't know if we need that many that that much of a capacity. 135 might be a bit much. Actually, you know what? Better safe than sorry, right? It's only gonna become more people there eventually as we uh, build more buildings. So let's go ahead and purchase uh, some of the Chav buses before I do that. 2.25 is where we're sitting right now, and we've been having a good year so far. Cool. So let's go ahead and get the IKR-280, right? And let's get you starting over here. You're going to pick up only students. Only students. And you're going to drop them off over... Where is it? Here. Uh, no unloading up there. Only unloading over here. Right, so... Um, I should also actually get this to go... Let's see. Well, the school, the young kids should be going to this school over here, no problem. Yeah, it's only, yeah, it's only like university age students, it looks like, that are, are over here. And I actually, I, I, I thought I couldn't add, um, stuff. Hold on, <laughs> let me check here. Yeah, for students, you can't tell them where to go, can you? Well, you can. No way. And adult children, can you tell them where to go? Oh my god, you can. 
Well, okay, no, it just adds to the whole... No, oh, interesting. Well, okay, so far it's been working okay, though. Right, so far it's been working fine, so I'm not going to change that, but that's, uh, that's good to know. That's got to be a recent thing. That's got to be a recent thing, or maybe I just misused it in the past. Either way, okay, that's good to know, because... What I can do then, is I can get the, uh, children over here. I can specify where the kids should be going on some of these, uh... Bet you got school five, yep. You... Because that way we can share the load a little bit, basically. Over here. Let's get you going over there. What about adult children? I don't want them going to... Yeah, it's weird. We'll see how this works out, because do the university-educated people go into this school as well? That doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense. So we'll see how that works out. This is our little test block. Um, and then we'll we'll adjust accordingly. The school is right here. I wonder if we send the kids from here over here. And the kids from here over here as well. Just to, again, share the load a little bit. Oops. Children, go here. And children, go here. Okay. That'll hopefully help this class, these classrooms fill up a bit more and send some more students to this one. And it'll hopefully help empty these classes a bit more and allow more of these people to go over here. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Sorry. Uh, so, yeah, we've taken care of one. You try to solve one thing, you end up looking at like four different things. Am I right? Uh, so, hopefully, now the students from this train platform will be taken to the university and we'll solve that issue. Another thing that was pointed out was the whole semaphore thing in the south block. The thing is, I can't... I need to figure out why a train continues even though this is not empty. And I think I need to have a chain over here. There we go. That, I think, should do it. That, I think, should solve the problem we've been having down over here. Uh, and then we'll have that working smoothly. This will hopefully be working smoothly. We are not currently exporting steel, if I'm not mistaken. Where is our steel train? Where are you, buddy? There you are. Yep, last bit of steel we're exporting. Then we're going to stop for a little bit. And we're not... Uh, we have a couple of people working on mechanical components. You know what? Let's, let's cancel it. I want to get these constructions done so that things can smooth out a little bit. So that is all of that done. Um, I think we fixed the sound for a problem. I think we fixed this. And uh, there was a mention that we are telling students. Well, oh, there's a train at least that's telling students to get off over there. I don't think that actually matters, by the way. I don't think it matters who, because what matters is who you're picking up, not who you're dropping off. Um, yeah, like over here we could get rid of that. I, I think that's the one that we we're talking about. Anyways, let's hit play. <laughs> let's get time moving forward now. And uh, let's also see the construction, hopefully, of this track get completed. Uh, I believe we have all the connections we need. It's just a matter of uh, time and the semaphores and whatnot. So let us proceed with time. Uh, we're at 2.23 after purchasing that new bus. And yeah, right. What's on the topic of bus? What is the deal over here? You are doing what? Let's get you moving. I guess we don't have enough clothes here to top this up. Hmm. Interesting. But you're gonna unload some clothes over here. Yeah, this is this is not ideal. Wondering. Yeah, see, just had to clear out a little bit. Wow, that was a serious traffic jam. Wondering if we make this like a two, uh, two side by side roads. I wish there were bigger roads. I wish there were. Like, you can kind of artificially make bigger roads, I suppose. But I don't know if the AI or if the, like, vehicle pathfinding really understands how to take advantage of that. The other thing I should probably do is actually, yes, at some of these construction sites, buy some uh, flatbeds. The problem is, I mean, I could probably get rid of some of these IKR um, 280s. This one already doesn't have that many because it's got the pavers and the rollers. I could... We have some open hull trailers. Let's see. Flatbeds. Like, I imagine the open hull trailer... I guess that's not technically a flatbed. It's an open hull. Because it still has a lifted bit. Is a flatbed a different... Hmm. 
I don't see it. I don't see it as a separate thing. With crane... Can load vehicles on flatbed. Okay, so our LZ-100 can load vehicles on flatbed. So we do have something to load vehicles. So why... Why don't you? How do I make you load vehicles as opposed to other stuff? I mean, I guess we just have so much going on that they're just doing anything they can at any given time. That's what it seems like to me. That's what it seems like to me. So, I mean, fair enough. There's not much I can do about that. Hopefully the construction here... I mean, it's progressing pretty nicely. The roads are getting completed here. People will... I think people will start to move in as soon as the roads are done. Because obviously right now they don't have access to anything. So hopefully that'll be done soon. Uh, I maybe prematurely built some of the road sections out, but, you know, it's not the end of the world. Um, again, I could just pay for these, but that kind of defeats the purpose, right? Electronic components are being dropped off, right? Because there's uh, street lights and stuff over here. This road section has been completed. I believe I paid for that at the end. And these guys, okay, so we don't, we aren't yet receiving people. I guess we received some people here at some point. You're connected to here with the wood. Fair enough. Okay. And it looks like Fabric has gone through. Missing fabric. You're missing chemicals. But it looks like, uh, because we did have fabric over here, and it looks like it has pulled through, so that's good. That's good. Did you just drop chemicals off? No, you just picked up no fabric, because there is none here. Fair enough. This will all smooth out as soon as these guys start moving in. Okay, uh, as the sun is rising, I'm going to get ready to get this stuff sorted out. Let's go ahead and check the uh, construction situation over here. Of course, you're stuck. I assume you're building... What section? Railroad 5, maybe? Railroad 5, yep. Go ahead and pause that construction. Jeez, so much going on right now. Go ahead and cancel that. There we go. A bit of teleportation magic. Hopefully we're going to finish this stuff off. And then, yeah, we're going to get the, uh, the trams in here. That's a lot of passengers waiting. I wonder if I should have more vehicles coming through to pick up more passengers. Like, that bus feels so small and insignificant. Students are being picked up fine, it seems, but... A lot of passengers. Hmm. Let's see. What are you doing? You're picking up from here as well, but you already pick up so many people. Yeah, you know what? I feel like the IKR 280 or whatever it is is needed for this as well. That's 300 passengers waiting there. Just sitting there looking pretty. Excuse me, you need to start. I forgot to give him the start command. <laughs> Whoops. Let's go ahead and buy... Yeah, the IKR 280. You... I wish I could, like, color code the vehicles so I could more easily recognize them. From here, we're going to pick up a bunch of passengers. And I think we're going to drop them off over here. Unload all the passengers. And I might actually need a second one as well. That's a lot of people looking for food, drink, anything. Literally anything. And they're not getting it over here, so I need to try and get them to the shopping center. The reason why they're not getting it over here is, again, because I have not fixed things yet. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is what I think we're going to do. Um, don't wait until unloaded. Over here as well. Don't wait until unloaded. You're coming through with meat. Oh, you've actually got meat. That's good. 6.5 tons. Only get rid of one ton over here. So don't wait until unloaded. See, what I've done is... I've overdone it, is what I've done. I've overdone it. I feel like I need to get rid of all of these trucks and reorganize my shipping. Completely. I really think that's what's necessary here. Because the one truck coming through with 5.5 tons of meat, or 6.5 tons of meat, only to have it eaten by the time it makes it back to the meat facilities, is useless to me. So, I, I think I need to fix that, right? You, we're gonna sell you. We're, we're going ham here, right? We're, we're going real hard here. Uh, shopping center... And the small shopping center. Which one's this? 
This big one, and then you go to the small one. Okay. Uh, get rid of that. Unload 100% over here. Keep this thing stocked up. Keep this thing stocked up. Okay. Um... Guys are waiting to pick things up at the bus stop. Fair enough. Lots of workers waiting over here. Hopefully we're picking them up a little bit faster than this. We're here to pick up students. Yeah, we do have students. I wish the bus stops moved a bit more smoothly. It's just like, come on, we have four slots. I'd expect things to move a little bit faster. A lot of workers waiting. Um, I might do... Um, maybe I need to swap this bus stop type out with something else. Uh, also it was pointed out that I should perhaps, maybe, maybe build the, um, where'd it go? <laughs> God damn it, where is it? Where are you? No, not the road cargo station. These icons are, maybe I'm just not reading them properly. Maybe it was removed. Oh, there it is, the T-34. Ah, uh, you know what, it would fit. It would fit and I could put it down here. We'll do it later, when I'm not building so much stuff. Uh, sorry, got distracted there again, well, for a second. Uh, lots of students here, good, 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 this is all working fine, this is all working fine. Let's go ahead and find more trucks. Related vehicles. You, you're bringing meat. You're bringing meat. You're coming down here, you're gonna unload 100% of it, wait until unloaded. This time around, wait until you're unloaded. You, you have a complicated thing. You pick up some food, some alcohol, lots of clothes, and then you go to the shopping center and the pub. Which shopping center is this? The small one. I, I think what we'll do instead is... Cancel that, cancel that. Do that. Right, so you are just responsible for clothes. Now, see, it's too... It's too big for the shopping center. Four tons is all we can actually hold here at a given time. If I sell you, what happens to all these goods? Do I just lose 6,000 worth of, of clothes? Let's see if we can't wait until unloaded. That's the meat, and this is food. Yes, so this is fine. You can only carry four tons, you are coming. That's, I think what we need is, um, this was mentioned about passenger circulation in the comments, and I've actually been thinking this about uh, goods transportation for a while. What we need is more trucks carrying less product, because then it should uh, arrive and be used in a more sort of rotational fashion. I definitely need to do something about this. There's way too many buses coming to this one bus stop. Um, I could add a second bus stop to the side over here. And split up the load of either, you know, passengers and students and workers or something. This feels like a serious problem. So I need to, I need to do something about that. And up over here, what's the deal? Making good progress? Yeah, oh my god. Hey, this one's almost done. This one's about halfway done. This is crazy, yeah. And obviously we have to pay for some of these constructions. It's not the end of the world, though. Um, more steel coming through. Yep, yep, yep. Good stuff. And despite not exporting steel and... S what are you... Really? <laughs> I guess that's not enough to export five rubles worth of steel. Fair enough. Um, but yeah, so... Well, we're maintaining a decent economy without having any exports right now. Well, without having any major exports. So, feeling kind of comfortable about that. Let's go ahead and... What are you working on, buddy? Railroad number eight. Just need to keep an eye on this more often. Railroad number eight is the top one. Let's go. You can come down, you can finish that off. Can we actually add this section, please? Road connection doesn't exist. How not? How not? You've got this. Oh, I guess because it's a one way. Um, alright. Make it a two way for now. Make this a two-way as well. Make this a two-way as well. Just for the construction purposes. Now we should be able to get people down over here. 
Railroad number two. Get to it. Let's get to this as well. Road connection doesn't exist with this one. Well, it'll be done soon enough. All right, cool. Hopefully that uh, does the trick. You're stuck here trying to build number eight. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of number eight. I think it's the top one. No, it's not the top one. Oh my God, I hate when they go all the way back. Come on, number eight. You, gone. Okay. All right, I hope this works out. Got to make sure these road, these trains don't get blocked off because of that adjustment. Uh, all right, what's the deal here? This truck has arrived. Both of these trucks have arrived. You are unloading all of your clothes and you are unloading all of the meat. We're topped up right now, but that's fine. Until a food truck arrives, that's fine. And then we're going to sell these guys off uh, as is. As is. I'm, I'm tired of people starving. I'm tired of people making fun of the fact that people are starving. <laughs> I'm done with that. I'm done. No more. This. this. Okay, where, where, where? We've got a lot of vehicles coming here. We've got too many vehicles coming here. That's a serious problem. This is good. Lots of shoppers coming through. And we're not out of any goods or anything, so that's good. And what about the... What's the deal over here? Still some passengers waiting, but... I mean, they have to wait for a little bit. It's not like it'll be consistently at zero, especially with such a, a crowded platform. And such a crowded area, even. I guess we're out of workers right now. Just the one. Fair enough. That's not going to be enough. <laughs> yeah, I think we're fine there. And it looks like we're... Again, I'd like to have another train coming down here, but that's that's a that's an eventually. That's not a right now. And it'll also be smoother once um, this area is done, right? Looks like this road is... Oh, good. We've got this road completed. This road is completed as well. Don't really like this connection, but I don't want to spend the resources to upgrade it. We're fine over here. What's going on? What's going on? Have we not got... Um, you guys assigned? What about you? I would hope you're assigned. Yeah, just not focusing on it. The iron ore processing plants, I guess, have been prioritized. Not a problem. Uh, all right, I'm trying to figure out what to do with this situation. What do I want to do here? Because we want to we want to add more buildings over here, right? We want to have well, we want to have this track curve around, which will take a fair bit of space. Get the curve looking nice, right? These guys have the pleasure of living next to the track, and then we're gonna have more buildings down over here in this section. So do we get another bus stop over here to supplement this one? And then further down, we have more bus stops down there. I don't know if I want to destroy any of this road segment, any of these road segments, sorry, to build a, uh, a, a bus stop like uh, like one of these. They have been quite good, though. They, they get less crowded, I guess. But is their capacity just smaller? I imagine they have a smaller capacity. What's a good busy one? What would be a busy one of those? I don't know if we have any. I think 8 needs to be cancelled again. No, this is just unfinished railroad. Come on, which one? Bottom one? Bottom one. Cool. Um, yeah, that's that's something I'm worried about. It's like, do they have a lower capacity? I don't think they do. I don't think they do. So what I could do is... Um, break some of the track or break some of the road outside of the university we already have one like it over here probably too far for these guys though I might be better off just building another bus platform over here and getting another connection I'm trying to figure this out because if I build let's see where is it A large bus platform. Like about here. We'll have to flatten things a little bit. Maybe I'll wait until the sun rises. I just feel like it would free up some of the... Like, backlogging, so to speak, in this area. Oh yeah, we're able to fit over here. We're able to fit over here. And then... There we go. Can we get closer? That's about as close as we can get. Fair enough. We can do something like that. Get a top-down view here. I want to try and make it as straight as possible. Go ahead and flatten you a bit more. There we go. 
That might allow us to get a little bit closer. Nah. That's about as close as we can get. But I don't like that diagonal road. So it'll be like over here. We'll put you down. My only issue is that it kind of ends road connections because only buses can pass through. So the other option is to actually do a bus stop like this. That it can pass through. You know what? I think we'll do that. Pop it down over here. Yep. I'm tempted to almost just pay for this. Uh, lighten the load over here a bit. But first, before we get distracted by that, again, priorities. Over here, food is empty. So it is time for one of you to go. Who has less valuable product? The meat. Sell this vehicle. Away you go. All right. One ton of meat is all this can store at a time. One ton of meat. At least the f food is coming. Well, hold on. Excuse me. Were you not carrying food? I guess you were not. You're carrying clothes. Drop off. Oh, wait. Hold on. Christ. What have I done? What have I done? Another one with clothes. We have so many clothes just being shipped around. You know what? Um, the hell with this. The hell with that. We're gonna go ahead and get you unloading everything over there. And same thing with you. Let's let's empty these uh, these goods out. Go ahead and add the warehouse. Unload everything. Come on. <laughs> Couldn't click there for a second. Let's go, let's unload everything, and, uh, and expedite the process a little bit. And yeah, let's go ahead and expedite this process as well. It's not that expensive. A couple rubles here and there. And again, the reason why I went with this one is because I do want to have the road continue eventually. Right, so I want to have this style instead. Now, let's go ahead and see what we're doing over here. So workers are... Don't unload over here. Why are people not, um... Unloading over here. I need to see what this bus does. It's carrying way more workers than it should be when it arrived here. Oh, maybe, you know what, maybe it went to fuel up, I guess? Feels like it did. I'll just see what this does first. I will split the load between these two, uh, bus stops. What are you carrying? Nothing. Alright, how are we looking over here? You're gonna come through. What are you doing? We're getting ready to move out. Okay, good stuff. Oh my god, what's going on here? This is also not great. A lot of workers just disappeared because they couldn't unload, I guess. Oh, that's so weird. Unload all the workers. What are you doing? That's just goofy. Come on. You're unloading all the passengers, so that's fine. Why are the workers not unloading? Like, this is this is a serious problem. <laughs> you just got rid of one. Okay, this is weird. Well, here's what we're going to do. Go ahead and tell you to start over here instead. Load only workers. And unload them over there. Let's see if that works. Might as well, right? Just doing a little bit of experimentation. Only passengers waiting there. Let's go ahead and tell workers from here. Go here. Rather than... There. Because you're bus stop number four, yeah. Oops. I always click on that instead. Where's the fire? We should have an uh, not an ambulance, but hopefully not an ambulance. Hopefully a fire truck coming here soon. Yeah, looks like we got one coming through. Good stuff. Um, sorry, back back over here. There you are. No, nope, you're carrying passengers. God damn it! Where where the worker truck go? <laughs> Bus. All right, this time he unloaded more, so that's good. Again, gotta watch our capacities over here. Now, what about? Okay, we've got you picking up. School children. 
should probably replace some of these buses with, um... The bigger ones. Right, fewer vehicles more often at some of these. Or I could get you moving here instead of here. What do you- what, what does this bus even do? You're just picking up and dropping people off everywhere. Whoops. Th this bus needs a purpose. I'm gonna get rid of it for now. As I, I just have too many buses. I, I, I overdid it at the beginning, I think. With all these buses. Alright, what are you? Clothes. Time to get rid of you, I think. Yes. Gone. Getting rid of all these useless trucks. Look at the traffic there. That's a problem. Where's the other useless truck? Where are you? Don't hide from me. Okay, you're carrying food, so that's good. You. Gone. Don't need you anymore. Alright, so. Now we're gonna fix this problem. I think. I hope. <laughs> I hope. We need one more vehicle that can bring us four tons of food. So let's go ahead and buy a covered hull or tons of food. The JE300 seems to be doing the job well enough. Right, just want to make sure there isn't a better option. 9,000. The JE300 is feeling like the right call. 9,000. Oh, that's two pages. Yeah, okay, fine. So, JE300. Did I say 3,000? I meant 300. You, my good friend, you're going to pick up food from where? You're going to pick up food from here. Right? Start here. You're going to pick up food. And you're going to drop it off over here. Picking up only food. Cool. Begin. Four tons of food comes through. Unload. So we've got two trucks bringing food. Clothes. Four tons of clothes. Let's go ahead and get a JE... 300. Just the one, because clothes, I don't think they get purchased as often. So you. You're going to start at this warehouse, and you're going to end at this shopping center. You're going to load up only on clothes. And you're going to unload all of that. You're not going to wait. Again. One thing I should do is, uh... You, let's wait until you're unloaded. Well, actually, no, let's not. Because it, there'll be a fluctuation, right? So let's not wait until it's unloaded. Uh, so that is clothes and food. And then meat can only be one ton at a time. So, refrigeration. Two tons, eight tons, three tons, six tons, 1.8. 1.8 it is. Two of these. Start with you. You're going to go over to here. You're going to pick up meat. You're going to drop it off over here. And the reason why I'm... Oh, okay. I would prefer to, uh... Again, don't wait while unloaded. So let's start you. Give it like 20 seconds. Or so, you know, let it have a little bit of a move. Uh, and that way we'll have a little bit of separation between that first one and this second one. Uh, which will also go over here to pick up the meat. And then go over here to drop it off. And I really want this to work nicely. I really hope that starts getting goods here a bit more smoothly. It's a long way to go, yes. So I might need to add, I need. I might need to make it three trucks per uh, product. But we'll see about that when the time comes. Okay, we're making progress over here. Tell me you're not empty. Three workers. Not, not the best. We are making progress, though. Gotta upgrade that road section over there as well. Down over here, what are we looking at? Getting 100% of the passengers from here. What about you? Yeah, you're useless, aren't you? What's happening at this bus stop? What's happening at this bus stop? Oh no, you're taking people to train Rexki. Oh, 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 I see, I see. You're taking people to here. Fair enough. Well, it should just be get out. And it should just be get in. There. That's why I like to customize those so I can more easily read what's going on. 
We have enough workers over here? We do. We do have enough workers. So here's the other thing. Like, the, the reason why I want to have more trucks picking up less goods is because I need this to move through faster. And when one truck comes through to pick up 6.5 tons of a good, it becomes a problem. But here, we need that much food, so it's fine. I'm not going to complain about that, so it's fine. This bus stop is a little overwhelmed, I think, maybe. Seems to be doing okay. Slowing down every once in a while. Uh, I don't know how I feel about this. It's a very fine balancing act, isn't it? Over here, you're going to the coal mine. The only unload. And over here... I don't want... These guys. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Hopefully I've spread the load a little bit at least. As you're coming through. You look like you're pretty fast as well, so that's good. Chopping center. Okay, it needs meat. It's topped up on food. And this thing is going to, what, stay here until unloaded? Yeah. Am I fine with that? I think I am fine with that. Because then we'll have one cycling piece, but food is always here. Because food gets consumed, like, immediately, I think. Right, so let's go ahead and do that. And then meat's going to come through. Let's see how quickly meat goes away. Also, like, immediately. So you know what? Wait until unloaded. Is that extra point eight could go a long enough way? It'll last a little bit longer. Maybe until the next truck arrives. Again, it's so variable. It depends on so many factors, right? But this is certainly feeling a lot better. Number of shoppers up front is ridiculously high. We might actually need another shopping center. Wish more people would come to work here. If we're maxed up at 25, we'd be able to support a lot more people shopping. But again, this rush might just be because we finally have product here. <laughs> God. Embarrassing. Embarrassing, I tell you. Got workers without a job. Well, why don't you why don't you work over here then? Buddy. I wonder where they're all going for work, actually. I I wish I mean you can hover over each individual person in a place and, and, and find out where they're going. Oh, we got enough. Oh, alcohol. You know what? I'm not bringing any alcohol in here. 7.5 tons. I forgot to uh, make an adjustment for that. Let's go ahead and buy... Uh, I'm guessing that's covered hull. 7.5 tons of alcohol. 6.5.75. Where are we? Come on. 6, 6.5. Alright. Looks like 6.5 is the best we can do. So you're at 10k. Oh, eight's the best we can do at 11k. Let's go with uh, 6.5. Let's go with this one here. Sure. You. You're going to start at the distillery. You're going to end at the pub. Which is this. And again, I just like having the icons here to tell me exactly what they're going to pick up. And drop off. Let's begin. Wait until unloaded? I think so. Wait until unloaded, because we only have the one vehicle coming through, so I think it should be fine. But we have a bare minimum amount of alcohol being purchased as well, so people are never left without beer. <laughs> God, really should be the other way around. I'll say the meat is almost dried up. The food is almost done for as well. Clothes we still have. Looks like that's meat arriving. Nope. That's an ambulance. Where are our trucks? Almost out of food and meat. Food is on its way over, it looks like. Yep. Yeah. Okay. We've got a short distance to go. Look at that count. Holy crap. I wonder if we need another shopping center. And the answer is yes. The answer is yes, we need another shopping center. The question is, where? We get one over here for all these guys to go to. And then one over here for all these guys to go to. I think that might be the wise call here. And do we go with a small shopping center or do we go with uh, not a cinema? That would not help. 
a large shopping center. And that way a lot of people can get their, um, their goods easily. If I drop it down like somewhere over here. Let's just see here. If I drop it down somewhere over here, I should be able to get sidewalk connections pretty easily. Um, I could do a warehouse if I put it elsewhere. If I put it like over here or something, I get a little warehouse that loads up on stuff instead. But I think people will be having a tougher time reaching it. If I put it over here, I can get a road connection pretty easily to, like, this center section. People will be able to get to it very easily. I can get sidewalk connections very easily as well. Well, that might be the smarter call. And that should be able to service quite a few people, right? Like, if I, if I take a look at this one, how far do we reach? We get, we get pretty far on this one. So if I get a shopping center over here, we'd probably cover all of these buildings... And maybe some of these as well. Nah, that's probably too far away. But we'd all maybe cover up to here. Take off the load a little bit on this one. I think we need to do that. Oh, I forgot to keep an eye on these guys. Oh, seven. Come on, seven. Which one are you? Where are you? Okay. Um, that might be a good idea. Holy crap, man. And meat, meat is nowhere to be found. I think that's partly because we, uh, aren't producing meat right now. Yep. Definitely part of the reason why. Oh, no. <laughs> this is a problem. I told myself I need to keep an eye on these, and I did not. Okay. Let's see, which one's this? This is Railroad 2. Hopefully that just happened. That did not just happen. That has been like that for a while. Wow. Oh my god. Bottleneck. We're so close to done. We're so close to done. It's because of that, that track being made two-way. So it was blocking this access over here. Alright. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. At least this first train that's picking everybody up is, is going to drop people off at Farminsky. But hey, at least, um, food has arrived here. So that's good. And a little bit of meat, but, you know, mainly food has arrived. Yeah, let's go ahead and get a shopping center down over here. I think it's necessary. And I think we'll try and build it. We'll see how long it takes. And if it takes way too long, we'll, uh, we'll pay for it. A proper, full-on shopping center. Um, again, warehouse is tempting. I could build at an angle, so we can also get a warehouse over here. That way we just load up the warehouse as opposed to um, the shopping center specifically. Because the shopping center, I think, only has one loading... Um, two loading areas. But a warehouse, I think, also only has two, right? A warehouse only has one. What about a road... Not an aggregate, but... Cargo station... That's really only for, like, pass-through. It is small, but it is only for, like, pass-through. You know what? I think we'll just do trucks like we normally do. Uh, let's go ahead and... Hold on a second. Have they got rid of waypoints for roads? No, they're there. Um, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? Equipment. Shopping center. Full-size shopping center. Go ahead and get you placed over there. We can weave through the roads over here. Or, well, yeah, then the sidewalks can go down south. Or we do something like this. The sidewalk connection like that, and the road connection over here. That's probably a better idea. That's probably a better idea. Because then the delivery vehicles can come from the bridge and, like, cut off over here and move up this way. That's definitely a better idea. Let's go ahead and put you down over... Where? Here. Hmm... Let's try, yeah, let's try over here. Right over here. Little mall for these students to go to as well. Why not? Okay, let's drop you off over here. Hopefully that'll serve people properly. Get a footpath. Over here, straight connection. What other infrastructure could possibly be in the way? Oh, it's just all these roads. Fine, you know what? We don't need all the roads. We can get rid of this section. 
Though I do hate how it looks after you do that. There we go. So, let's go ahead and do that. Let's get you... Down over to here. Over like so. Alright. Start construction. And then roads. Regular roads. Um, like what I want to do is I want to pull this thing straight up, right? We do something like that. And then... There we go. That. 12k, holy crap. Well, let's go ahead and demolish this section so it's not wasting any of our time. That'll be good. And then this shopping center, again, should be reachable by quite a few people, I should hope. Tempted to pay for this. It can't be all that expensive. Yeah. Just so I can see. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm talking about. Pretty good reach. We got one, two, three... Four, five, six, seven buildings. Seven buildings times 189 is 700, 900, um, oh god, no. 789, holy crap. Over, over a thousand, 400-ish? Over a thousand, five hundred-ish, so that should help, I hope. Now, we're not seeing many shoppers over here because we have no goods over here. We do really need to solve our meat problem. Again, that's reliant on this being completed over here. Tempting to just pay for this all right now. We're at 2.214, 1, 3 now. We're done building you. We're done building you, so that's good. I wonder if... Have I assigned? I have not. Um... You know what I don't have? What I don't have is... A walkway up to here. Hmm. Easy way for people to get from this train platform up to there. And what I'd probably end up doing is find a connection up to there. Yeah, so there's a way to do it. Oh. There we go. other infrastructures in the way. Come on. Don't be like that game. Too bad. Go ahead and cancel this. Do something like that. Sure. And this we can we can pay for. Yeah, easy, easy connection. We'll have to pay for some of these, as we know. I don't think we can... Actually, we should be able to build some of these. Let's see. Get uh, this construction office. Oh my god, we're working on so much. And a road connection doesn't exist. Really, to this day. That's annoying. You'd think they'd go to this site. Oh, I guess this doesn't have a road connection either. Ah, fair enough. Fair enough, we saw this coming. This is seeing some good progress. Still needs a ton of steel. Oh my god. It's time to start uh, getting some people here again, I think. Jesus, we are topped up. Stoppages are over. Are you stuck here or are you building? I guess you're building, you're just waiting for people? Yeah. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Something I would very much like to do as well is, um, play at double speed for some time at some point. So no construction sites have been assigned here yet, and I'm fine with that. This is not a high priority at all. This is honestly, I think, more of a priority. We do have construction offices assigned across the board. Okay, fair enough. We need, uh, we need progress there. Livestock coming through, great. So we'll have some meat finally. Speed things up. You're going through towards Farminsky. Here we go. Livestock coming through. Meat being produced. Excellent. If it'll get picked up. Good enough. So you pick up directly from the slaughterhouse. And you go to the shopping center. Okay, fair enough. That's the big shopping center, so that's fine. And just like that, all of the livestock has been used up. 
What are you picking up? Food? Food seems to have been mostly solved. I might need another... Oh, no, you know what? I think food has mostly been solved. Uh, okay. I, I take it back. I take it back. Food is still a problem. Maybe we add another truck? We're producing food quickly enough, though. Yeah. We're producing food quickly enough. Go ahead and get... Uh, where are we? You purchase another... Covered hull. Start here. We're gonna pick up food. We're gonna drop it off over here. Get specifically food. Unload specifically food. Let's begin. Okay, more livestock has arrived. That's good. Yeah, see, our problem is just having workers down over here. And once we solve that, I think the meat problem will be closer to being solved. It won't be solved, but it'll be closer. You have picked up some meat and you're headed back? Yep. You are going to pick up some meat? No, you're not, because there is none available. Yeah, I'll see, that's the problem. And you, I mean, you're picking up food and alcohol right now. How do you loop back? Do you come around this way? I'm actually curious how this thing loops back. Okay, it does just flip around. Fair enough. That's a good train for us. That's a good money-making train for us. Look at that. Just with a little bit of fabric and a little bit of clothes. Oh. New crane type. Interesting. Interesting. Now, mechanical components are being made as well, right? Yep. And you are loading up on them. Yep. Okay, good stuff. Now, what is up with the steel that is not being brought up over here? You've got open hulls. We should be fine. I don't want those vehicles there. You. What are you up to? Let me see how much steel it picks up. I want to make sure it is picking up steel. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, okay. We are, we are getting steel. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Because we have a lot of loading spots as well. Though there shouldn't be that kind of a slowdown. It's just a matter of distance they have to cover. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Okay, so that's working. That's working. This is... This is... Working-ish. I am looking forward to having this uh, shopping center completed. Roads being worked on, so that's good. I'll let this have its natural progression. Sidewalks being worked on as well. I wonder if once that sidewalk's completed, we'll, if we'll have access to these guys down here as well. That'd be good. Again, it'll just take the load off of the shopping center a little bit, I think. And food, I mean, hopefully food's gonna stop being a problem soon. Ah, oh, God, I don't know, I don't know if that's <laughs> the case. A lot of problems over here. The reason why they can't enjoy culture or anything else is because they're not able to uh, to get those bare necessities. Oh, this is a problem. Honestly, all for this one unfinished railroad. I'm starting to think I could just uh, auto build it. Come on. There we go. Gotta keep the stuff moving. Otherwise, we're in serious trouble. Okay, load up, load up. Good stuff. I, don't, I, don't, I think we noticed that one pretty quickly. Are you not done? That one looks like it's done. What are you trying to build? There's nothing left to build here. Let's try to build this. Railroad number four. Is that on the list over here? No. Damn. Damn. Why are you just stuck here? This one's just stuck here. Well, okay, time to get rid of you. I have no patience for this kind of thing right now. <laughs> Absolutely zero. Wait, hold on a second. Hold on a second. We're starting to use this track. That's not how this is supposed to work. No, 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 no. You weren't supposed to do that. You were not supposed to do that. You fool. You fool. Okay. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. 
We're fine. You'll find your way out. <laughs> oh, it never ends. What are you trying to build over here? Nothing in particular, it looks like. So let's go ahead and cancel. It's left. Yeah, see, this one's just stuck here. And it should have a path back. Oh, it does not. There we go. Now it has a path back. Alright, hopefully it'll be fixed. But it's not how that was supposed to work. Ah, see, this is a problem. Gonna get stuck over there eventually. Um. Jesus. You really screwed me this this time around here. <sighs> Getting itself stuck. I'm not I'm not about to sell it. Do I seriously have to make all of these two ways? My other option, of course, is to actually build that connection over here that I was talking about. But no, because it'll have to go up this way. Jesus. <laughs> this is hilarious. And by hilarious, I mean very unfortunate. Oh, come on, game. <laughs> oh, come on. Alright, fair enough. Um, let's see, how do we, how do we do this? The other option is, of course, to just send this train up and around to there. A little unceremonious. And on its way back, it can come back well, actually, it can't. It is stuck here now forever. It is stuck here now forever. I mean, I could do a crossing over here. Right? I can pay for this. It can go out. It can end up on this side. And it would go, 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 go. Not have a connection over here. I could make one, maybe. Yeah, I could make one. Saw green. There we go. I think that implies a connection? I don't- I can't tell. Honestly can't tell. I mean, I might just have to do something like this instead. Wow. Real, uh, real clean looking. 8,000. I might just pay for it all. I might just pay for it all. We got this kind of money. i get you done. And get you done. And you know what? I'm tempted to just pay for this section as well. Let's do it. Bit of a bummer, but... Oh, of course, this is a cross crossing over here. So why wouldn't I have a crossing already planned? Okay, now you should be able to get out of here. You're not. Why not? You should be able to go... I can't believe I'm... It all boils down to this. You should be able to go here. And then cross over. Go this way. And then cross and... Oh, right, because you still end up stuck over there. All right, what I need is you. Oh, okay, I do have you planned. Man, what a mess this has been. There, now you should be able to get out. I'm going to undo all the, the messy tracks I laid down. should be able to get out. Can't put some for there. Come on. Don't mess with me, game. Okay. Dude, what's the deal here? What's the deal here? Come through there. This is not turning green. Go ahead and cancel some track. Go ahead and cancel. You know, we might as well pay for this. Go ahead and cancel. Oh, I guess there's still some construction to be done over here. I just couldn't tell. Fair enough. Get rid of you. Go ahead and get rid of you. Get rid of you over here, please. Yep. And get rid of you over here. 
Yep. Are we are we done here? No, we're not. There, done. Now we're done over here. So now you can come through. We're gonna. <laughs> what a goddamn mess. Get rid of you, and get rid of you. That was a waste of like ten to twenty thousand rubles right there. Okay, you can finally get the hell out of there. Somehow these workers have decided to stay. All right, good for you. Now listen, um. We need to build waypoints, don't we? To stop that mess from happening again. I think we do. I think we need waypoints. I mean, I don't mind if things come up over here, I suppose, but I'd like to have a clean connection. Like, yeah, see, it's going to opt to come up over here because it's a clean angle. Now, that could actually work out for me quite nicely in, 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 in keeping people moving up to this very crucial part of... Uh, of our Soviet Republic. So that is an option. On the topic of which, are we almost done here? Close. 37 more tons of steel, which I imagine we're picking up soon. Yeah, trucks are coming through. And what's the deal over here? Progress is uh, being made. Workers are coming through, electronics are coming through, progress is being made. And over here, fabric is missing. Well, is fabric missing? I should hope not. Because we are producing it right now. Hmm. Oh, I guess it's being loaded up on this truck. Yeah. Fair enough, fair enough. Not the end of the world. Steel is being brought down over here as well. Because all these things have, um... Like, uh, streetlights and stuff. Goddamn. Anyway. No food over here right now, so that's, you know, fantastic. That's how you know it's a successful... We've successfully solved all the issues we're looking to solve. You, you're bringing food. Cool. So, it's right around the corner. Like, literally right around the corner. So that's good. Hopefully, I mean, hopefully... This shopping center will solve... Some of the issues. Yeah, one, two, three... Four, five, six, seven... Buildings. Where do you go to shop? We do not have a shopping center. You must. They must be taken down to here with the bus stop. Cool. Okay, cool. Jesus. This was a bit of an adventure of an episode, I suppose. Are we getting stuck up here? No, we're not. We're moving. Yeah, what I need to do is I need to give these some of these trains maybe waypoints. Definitely want to get some trams down here to ship people all the way up to here. A little bummed out that I had to pay for so much at the end, but we got that train stuck and I had to get it out. Um, otherwise, we just more trains would come down here. But hey, you know what? At least this is working nicely. At least we've got a nice layout over here. In fact, one thing I need to do is fix up the semaphores. Um, so you are a one-way. You are also a one-way, I think, right? You'd be a one-way this way. You'd be a one-way that way. These are two ways. So you can end up on either side of this track as needed. Yep. You roll out on one side. This is a chain one way it should be. Let it pass through first. Oh, there. Do that. You're supposed to be a chain one way. You are also a one way, and you are also a one way. Cool. What's blocking this one way right now? A strange time to be blocked. Oh, I guess, you know what? It's supposed to be a chain. Because it faces into a junction, right? Okay. That seems reasonable. Now, this is a one-way going into this section. We have you coming out over here. From there, yeah. Might clean this construction track up. We don't need it anymore. I think this will solve the problem. There's a lot of construction assistance track that we can clean up over here if we wanted to. Including the rail construction house, or yard, or office, or whatever itself. If we felt the need. It served us well so far. Feels bad destroying something that served you well. Workers are coming through here okay. Here we are producing some mechanical components. Every once in a while. It's okay, it's okay. Once this gets done, we'll be uh, doing a lot more. 
iron is not being pulled down. Well, that's because we're not moving steel quickly enough. And yet our economy is doing okay. It's just because I don't want trucks that come down to be interrupted on the, uh, during pickup. Hmm. Okay, we're, we're fine, though. We're fine. We, you know what? We've done, we've done pretty well. We've done pretty well. Oh, perfect timing. Just as so I was coming down to take a look at these new trucks. God, I, I hope this solves the problem. I really hope it solves the problem, folks. We might need to add more trucks to make it a more consistent flow. But, uh, but I think we're getting there. I think we're getting there. Anyway, folks, as you can probably tell, this is where we're going to call it a session. It's been a good one, I think. We've made some progress. We've finished the tracks to train, oh, sorry, the tracks to Rustinski have been completed. Train Rexki has seen some progress, and I think that shopping center has seen some progress as well. And we're getting a new shopping center built as well. We are at 2.23, so I think we've ended a little bit below what we started, but this year is still profitable. So still feeling pretty good about it. Still feeling pretty good. Uh, hopefully Rustinski will be up and running soon. Hopefully food and meat will be solved over here soon. And then we can continue building our automobile hub that we've planned across the river. Folks, thank you as always for watching and for joining. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do. Let me know by leaving a like and a comment down below. It really helps you make judgment calls on the channel. As always, a massive thanks goes out to all of my channel members and patrons for supporting the channel on a monthly basis. You keep us alive and running smoothly. And a big old thanks goes out to each and every one of you for watching. Until next time, das vidanya.